out here question is in the context of a ripple tank and it's asking us about refraction. It could be in the context of uh, light waves or anything, um, but let's dive into it. So it tells us it's refraction and it says explain why fraction, refraction happens at the boundary between deep and shallow water. So these are wave fronts, these are like ripples as it goes along um, and you'll notice as soon as they reach shallow water they start to change and they change in this direction here. So let's explain it first. Now um, hopefully it's obvious that if I was this wave traveling along here and here the side that hits it first would be this one just because the angle uh, that the change is at. So that's our first comment to make which is that the side that hits it first is essentially the bottom part of the wave. Okay, The bottom we could say right from its point of view uh, but the bottom part of the uh, wave front hits uh, or reaches the boundary first. So because it hit, reaches the boundary first, and we need to know what happens. Well, when a wave goes from deep to shallow water, it refracts because um, there is a change in depth. So what happens is the wave slows down first. So that part, so that part would slow down first before the other wave. Okay. You could also put the extra information here. You could say the wavelength uh, decreases as well. Increases. Uh, and then you'd say, well, it hasn't actually told us what refraction is. So that's a key clue in a question like this. It would slow down first, meaning the wave um, bends or changes direction towards the normal. Now, I'll tell you what that means in a second. Um, but you've got to talk about which way it's going to change direction. Um, you could say kind of down, but a better way of saying it's towards the normal. Normal is a perpendicular um, imaginary line uh, perpendicular to the surface. And if you imagine a wave coming along here, it is kind of going more in that direction, so it's towards the normal. Next part of the question um, is about the same situation, but um, the wave hits the line straight on, so it does not an angle. So why does it not refract? Okay, so it's not that the speed doesn't change, but the idea is that both the top and bottom, or the whole wave front, hit the boundary or reach the boundary at the same time. Okay, at the same time. So they both slow down um, at the same time. Time, so wave continues in the same direction, which is um, straight on and not turning uh, to the right or to the left.